Somebody who probably had nothing else once said that if you have your health, you have everything. One thing for sure is that your health really is everything to some innovators. There's one man who is working hard so that your doctors can give you care when they're not even there. Here's Allie Ward to explain. When simple health ailments have you or someone you love feeling under the weather, the last thing you want to do is hang out in a waiting room with more people who aren't feeling well. But this is Deddy Galad, and his company, TidoCare, has created an app-driven medical kit and cloud-based data transmission system that allows for basic home self-exams and electronic review by your physician. I went to New York City to get the pulse on a modern-day variation of old-school house calls. Now, why start this company? About five years ago, my youngest kid, Shaha, just went to the kindergarten in Israel. And during the first year, I would say almost every other week, I was with her at the doctor for various uh, throat and ear infections. Deddy says that often the interaction with the doctor was brief and the ailment was minor. And as an engineer, he asked himself if that interaction could take place from home without going to the doctor's office. His idea resulted in TidoCare. We invested a lot of efforts and time into making sure that every user, consumer, lay user without medical background can really operate the Tido very effectively. Tido can help you do an at-home preliminary exam of the heart, lungs, ears, skin, eyes, or throat. Then the readings collected from the home exam are shared through the cloud with your physician who can make an informed professional diagnosis. So this is the home kit. You're gonna show me how it works. What's in here? It contains the basic uh, title device, which uh, has a screen to interact with the device. It okay. has peripherals like snap-in, uh, a stethoscope for the lungs and heart, an otoscope for the ear, and a tongue depressor to do huh. any uh, throat examination with kids. We started by taking my temperature. Just like this? You wait for those five, six seconds and you're, you're good, so you're pretty healthy. That is so cool, so instead of having to shake a thermometer and exactly. hope you don't bite it. And with kids, it's very easy when they sleep or they're just lying down, you can just go check it without interfering them. So let's do the heart exam and maybe you can do it on your own. Okay, and it tells me right where to put it. And then I press start. You wait a few seconds. This was a perfect reading. I did it? Yeah, you're an expert. <laughs> <laughs> it's this white coat, it thinks I'm a doctor. Next, it was time to check my ears. Oh my gosh, this is as vulnerable as it gets, checking out your ear on national TV. That's my ear. Oh, that's so weird. <laughs> Once you finish the exam, you answer a series of questions about your symptoms. You have a quick questionnaire about the symptoms that drive you to do this exam. So you didn't feel well, you had a fever, throat that was aching, whatever. This is like ordering the weirdest pizza ever. <laughs> <laughs> so when ailments have you feeling like you're standing still, maybe this type of care will help get you moving again. 